and the girls and the Frenchels, it's Doll. Welcome back to my kitchen this Friday, and today I'll be serving you a flippin' awesome deck video where all my Pokemon happen to be colorless and depend on coin flips for unique effects. And I'm gonna show you how this deck works, how I built it, and you can see some flippin' awesome matches. So, first of all, you're looking at the trick coin because this is an important card for all my Pokemon. They all use coin flips. So uh, what this is, is flip a coin, if tails, flip it again, and hopefully it's heads. Basically, that, that's the idea. So keep it in mind when I go through the Pokemons. First of all, we're gonna start up Rabbit, Diggersby. Now you may know Regice, which is immune to EX Pokemon. That card has nothing on this. This thing can be immune to everything. So dig, flip a coin, if tails, flip it again with a trick coin. If heads, hopefully, then nothing can touch this. Damage won't affect it. Special strange effects won't affect it. So most Pokemons are not going to be able to touch this at all. It is near immortal until you get those unlucky two tails. But it's going to land heads very, very often. And if you cannot get rid of it soon, the 50 damage will build up and then that's it. So Diggersby is a very, very dangerous guy. And so that's a nice trick you're going to see very early on. And now we have Beavers, Bibero. Purple coins, if they keep happen to be heads, then you do 80, 160, 240. Casually, those big numbers just on the whim of coin flips. So he has the ability to trade with the ex Pokemons or the ability to just really stink. And you're gonna see both cases in this video, unfortunately. So moving on, we finally have Kangaroo. And okay, this, this the pre-evolution, uh, it's more of a support card. It's not that interesting. Uh, first attack, you just get three more cards, which is actually very useful for setting up. Second attack, flip a coin. If heads, you do 30 more for 100 total damage. That's nice. 70, that's still nice if you tail. So not too serious, but helpful. Now this is a god card. Mega Kangaskhan. I know there's no spirit link, but it's awesome. It's tough hit points as well as high damage potential is crazy. You're going to see this card just, just pull through and just, well, you'll see. It is awesome. It is awesome. And finally... We're gonna go with the only non-colors uh, evolution line, Whimsicott. That's a weird name. I, I'm probably gonna pronounce it like three different ways. Just warning you, just warning you. But what it does, the sheep, it moves the all damage counters, meaning it completely heals out a Pokemon and puts it on your opponent. So if your Pokemon's wounded enough, it acts as a big giant heal and just KOs whoever's in the active. That is amazing. You're gonna see how amazing this is, especially with this uh, big, huge hit point cards. And that's all coming up. Now, okay, we're gonna quickly blow through supporters because they're just very generic. Now I have double color synergies. All my Pokemon's pretty much use this. I mean, it's a colorless deck. Now I have Birch, Sycamore, Shauna. They're just big supporters to get lots of cards. Now, so what's special is for colors Pokemon's you like Winona because it grabs three color types. Pokemons, whichever you like, whichever you need, and puts them on your bench. We're, well, we have tons of these cards, and that's why she's just so awesome. Now, the teammates, if one of my Pokemons goes down, I get to pick whatever two cards I want, like maybe double color center entries or whatnot, and help keep the momentum going. I've got Lysander because he rules. I got Verse Seekers because it helps me repeat supporters. I've got Trainer Males, which will keep helps to flow of trainer cards and I've got sacred ashes because I'm depending a lot on Pokemon that not not supposed to survive very long so these can help recycle them and keep on trading with my opponent now you can't really have a fully color stick and I'm using fairy energies in fairy garden because I like free retreat costs my Pokemon's have awful retreat rates like this is three this is two okay but Kangaskhan 3 and 3, so yeah, free retreat, amazing. And that's pretty much the deck. So would you like to see some flipping awesome matches? Of course you do. Finally, Whimsicott's 
Um's guys gonna get a chance to shine after being with Gardevoir, where Gardevoir just destroyed everything. So, finally, it's gonna have his day. So here, here we go. Well, welcome to the Flip Nasa match. It looks like we're both starting off with Cottony, and he's got Florgus. But I got Bunnelby, I got Diggersby. You know, I think we're both using Fairy deck, so I'm gonna put that down there. And we'll charge up Bunnelby. And, nope, I'm keeping my hand, because definitely Bunnelby can go up next turn. Cottony is gonna be a, a bit in danger, but that's okay. All right, he had a wow, that's a lot of cards. Ooh, level ball. Maybe we miss or Whimsy Scott's got to come up. So that's not so good. So I really have to be careful about. Nope, it's Jigglypuff. So in the case, don't worry about Whimsy Scott, guys. Jigglypuff is coming. Wigglytuff is kind of bad. But Florgas is coming out. It must mean he already has the evolution in his hand, or it doesn't really care. So we're gonna charge up Bunnelby. And Bundle B is now a Digger's B, ready to go up, but unfortunately we have a con thing up front. So it's like, huh? One more turn, man. I'm gonna put an energy, retreat, and probably go with Nona and get my other cards out. Crackling noise. Wigglytuff, Hocus Pinkus. You, your defending Pokemon can't attack, but I'm immortal. Or I, I, I wish, I think I can, can be. So let's go ahead and retreat. There we go. We're gonna send out Digger's B. And it's really, do I have to worry about getting shot? Okay, let's get this gone. Let's get out. I want my Kangaskhan. I want my Kangaskhan. I want my barrel and my Bidoof. Oh, Mega Kangaskhan. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. Yeah, I'm gonna try to pull it out. Here we go. I'm gonna grab these and. Put them down on the bench. Let's go ahead and use Dig. Taking out the Scottney. So mine gets to survive Tails. Ooh, it's vulnerable. Another Kangaskhan. And Wigglytuff is gonna come out. I can't attack, but I have free retreat. I can deal with it. No, I needed that energy. That's okay, guys. It's okay. We got this. Oh, Hocus Pinkus. I cannot attack. And one more turn, I'm, I'm going down. Um, I have an idea. Let's go ahead and retreat. And if I play anything else, yeah, we're gonna make you go mega. I'm gonna take a couple of damage, just a little bit, just two shots, and we might try to, we might try to let Wema Scott gets this day. I mean, I gotta pull, I gotta pull something out with Sycamore, right? Right. Alright, so he's going to try to get a Aromatisse, which allows him to move fairy energies around. That's bad. Florgus is coming out. Ooh, Battle Report. That actually worked, but that's just like a Tierno, so it wasn't that cool. Plenty of energies. We're going to have to deal with the Florgus soon. 60 damage. That's okay. Take all the damage you want because it's coming for you. So now I'm going to charge up Kangaskhan. Should I be using another one? Yeah, yeah. Sorry, Badoo. Bye-bye. And we are going to use Sycamore. I need double colors. Well, we got a barrel. And what is this going to get me? What is this going to get me? It's going to get me a Trick Coin. I'll definitely take that. Okay. That's it, guys. Let me go ahead and put these Trick Coins on things I need like that. And a Diggersby. And I'm good. I'll take one more damn attack on purpose. If not, I'll start retreating into something else. So, he's gonna put a muscle band on. Hurt me some more. Do you more damage to me? Go ahead. Because I'm gonna hocus as pink as you. We is Lysander down there? He is not. But Weemy Scott is now out. And if I can teammates it next turn, I'm good. So, let's go ahead and throw this on. We'll retreat. And hi. He says hi. And I'm gonna use Windy Mischief, heal off my Genghis Khan, all of it, and that, 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 a little more would have one shot floor guys. So sorry, Wigglytuff. Oh, I can't believe I pulled it off. Finally, finally, you were, I had a Mega Gardevoir video, but Mega Gardevoir, the goddess was just way too strong, so this, this worked out. Unfortunately, 
this this the end for our Wimmy Scott. Don't worry, I have another one. I have another one. This is gonna work out. But now I can teammate into uh, double colors energy and Mega King's Kong can actually do some work. So it was a trap. It's a trap, guys. So okay, okay, calm down. Calm down. All right. It only oh he didn't use Bright Garden because there's not enough. There wasn't enough Benji Pokemon. So we just got to. I live. I live. So go ahead and retreat. Oh no, I have to. Anything in Sacred Ash? No. Okay, give me a double colors, man. Otherwise, otherwise. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I got a trick coin for whom? I don't know, don't have to decide yet. Bibero? Yeah, okay, we'll, just, we'll use Bibero. We'll use Bibero here. Way of bam punch. Um, heads, that's fine. Heads? Oh, did that knock it out? Oh my gosh, four heads, five? Six? Okay, that no, that's enough. Seven is great too. Eight? Okay. Oh, what? Eight? Didn't even get to see that. Oh, oh man, that was so awesome. here. Oh, welcome to another uh, flipping awesome match. I'm gonna send out my Bunnelby, and let's see what's in the mail. A trick coin. Okay, I'll take that. I'll take that and put it onto Bunnelby, and I'd rather have a Winona. So, okay, let's put an energy on you. Give me a Winona. What's in the mail? Winona, perfect. In that case, I'll use you my first turn. And we're gonna grab out Diggersby. Kangaskhan, Kangaskhan already had her day. So we're gonna grab out a barrel now. So gonna leave, gonna leave that there. And let's send out Bidoof. You know, we may both be using a fairy deck. I, I'm pretty sure we were, so we're, I'm just gonna throw it down there, not worried, because we both share the same stadium. So, alright. One more turn. One more turn. Bunnelby is going to go Diggersby, and it just needs a double colorist, and it's gonna be awesome. Alright, so Meryl's, Meryl's here with the flowers, and what does Meryl do? Meryl involves in Zumro, not sure what it can do yet. So, right, Tiano, more cards, a healing scarf. Oh, the combo, the combo. You can keep healing intensely, or just keep on healing with a... Well, we'll see. Azumaru has a bonus effect healing with his ancient trait. And with the healing scar, he might be able to keep it alive forever. We'll see, we'll see. 10 damage, but he's like, yeah, whatever. So, we're going to go sticker speed. We can go to god mode if we get a, uh, a double colors energy. You know, I need my support trainers. Let's just go ahead and Shoshana. Double colors energy. So let's go into God mode. We are going to use Dig and Flipper Coin. If heads, heads, perfect. You go, man. Nope. I'm gonna save this trick coin. I don't know why. Just in case, you know, there's some strange Discord. Hey, it's Zora Art. So I could just put it back on. I don't think he's running something like that, but who knows? So, Meryl, Meryl, you can't do anything at all. You gotta heal it now, man. You gotta heal it now. Evil Soda Azumaru. I can now show you what I'm talking about. It is now Az This is the right Azumaru. But okay. It evolved into Azumaru. It's not going to survive another turn. But he healed it with a Scarf. Zero damage. Digger B is like, aha, no way, man. And I paralyzed. It doesn't matter. I'm I'm good. So let's charge up the barrel. I'm going to sick more guys. So let's, let's, we have to play the trick coin. Okay, and we got Bunnelby, we got Cottony, we got Bidoof, we got one more spot for a uh, Kangaskhan. So, here we go, let's do it again. Dig, 50 damage. It's barely gonna, oh, that's Tails. It's barely gonna survive, and it's Tails again? Bad diggers be bad. Man. Just supposed to get heads all the time, man. So, I'm vulnerable to a paralysis, that is not good. Diggers be Okay, that was good enough. A zoomer again, not the ancient trait one, but the this regular one. So what's it gonna do? Is he gonna charge it up? Enhance hammer? No. Healed it more. Oh, this is zoomer is getting a comeback, guys. Sixty damage, but I'm not. Okay, you gotta redeem yourself. Let's go ahead and charge this up. We're gonna go for digger speed again. Okay. 
I'm gonna go for Sycamore. We're gonna hope for a double colors, man. Double colors, I need. Yes, yes. The last base is going for Kangaskhan. And, oh, I can use Bibero. I'm already evolved and ready to go. Let's go and dig. Go into your immortal mode. Come on, heads. There you go, man. Uh, nope, that's Brian. Takes out the Zazumaru and is immune to damage. Anything. Woo. Should paralyze me. And then um, Amaro comes out. Oh, give me some time. Give me some time. I got to charge up. He's taking those energies back. Okay. Oh, what am I going to do? That's nothing I really should do. How many cards do I have left in my hand? I don't need these cards. Let's go ahead and throw them all out with Sycamore. It's getting close, though. Oh, Sycamore. Don't need these. I'm set. I just need some good cards, man. And, who? I get Mega Kangas gone out. You know what? We're going to start charging it up. I'm going to save this in case he's got another Enhanced Hammer. Let's go ahead and send out We Miss God. And, I'm not going to go ballsy. Let's just go dig. Dig. Flip a coin. Heads. Immortal still. And that's it. That's it. So he cannot do anything to Digger's B. Man, you need a Hex Maniac for this. So, Hard Charm. Tanky Azumaru coming out. And let's see. Birch. Doesn't matter. He Tails. Okay. That, that, that sucks a little bit. And Azumaru evolves. Come on. If rabbits against rabbits. We'll see if, uh, we'll see if he can... This works. So, okay, we'll charge up Kangaskhan. It evolved, but it's not gonna go survive this turn. So, man, I, I, I kind of want to hold on to Kangaskhan. Nah, nah, we're gonna go dig and flip coin if it hits. No, 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 that's that's the tail. So you gotta do it again. You gotta do it, man, man. Here we go. Come on, you can go heads. You can go heads. So we took out another Azumaru, and this Azumaru comes out. It has energies. It can finish this off. Only 30 hit points. Oh, oh, no, no. Why, why did it have to be heads? He discarded, but you know, the effect is still in effect. Zero damage. It's like, oof, that was close. That was close. Okay. So. Okay, I'm gonna birch. I'm the one why I'm gonna birch. I'm just gonna birch. Because I need some more cards. Tails. You wanna give me another double colors birch? No, oh, fine. So, the only card that can actually knock it out now is Kangaskhan. So, let's take a free retreat. You've done a good job, Diggers B. And Head's gonna knock this out. No, wait. It has a heart charm. So, yep. Oh, Paralysis. Pokemon Center Lady. Man, this deck is tough. Okay more energy so I can a toga tick oh this might be the second toga kiss 60 damage okay I'm gonna charge up my Wee mascot you might I might just let's see no if I attack this this is no it has a hard charm so it really has to be heads okay I'm thinking about making it go mega you know what it's time to go mega I'm, I'll grab all these cards un unless I'm running out of cards. So I'm not going to grab all these cards. So I'm just going to get Mega King has gone out. <laughs> oh yeah. So it's going to He's keep us on charging up his Togetic. He might become a other Togetic. 90 damage. But you know the deal, man. You know the deal. Oh no. I'm going to retreat. Send out We Miss Scott. Windy Mischief. Completely heal you up. Woo! Full health. 150 damage. Goodbye, Azubaru. And now, we must got his left vulnerable, but that's okay. Mega King is gonna get to deal with this. And what is this? A, a Ralts. 40 damage. It survives. So let's go ahead and retreat. Send out Mega King is gone back out. And we're gonna use Wham Bam Punch. Just be Tails, man. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. We don't need any extra. A hundred damage. All right. Woo. And Ralt has come out. 
This is it. This is it. This is it. Victory. Who oh, win the stars? Let's see if I get lucky. Let's see if I get lucky. Here we go. Continuous headbutt. All oh, tails. Yeah, you gotta flip. Let's do it again. Do it again, man. Come on. One, two tails. Oh, zero damage. The barrel, why? He's gonna put team flare gear on. Okay. My bench is at the mercy of whatever. He's gonna drag out Cotney. I get a free retreat, but that's okay. Oh, I got a weakness guy. So, we're gonna evolve it. So it has uh, more life. Put energy on it. I can retreat. Let's go ahead and retreat. Do I need Winona? I guess so. Let's set up another Pokemon. The only thing I can set up now is another Bibarel, Bidoof thing. So let's go ahead and throw it down. Oh, I can set a bundle Diggers B2. Yeah, let's do that. Here we go. Tails? What's wrong with you? Tails again? Oh, man. Oh, I, 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 he's gonna drag out Weemascot again. What a jerk. What a jerk. Third time's the charm, guys. Third time's the charm. We're gonna send Diggersby up. Okay, Bibero. I know I can attach a double kill this energy. Not yet, because I don't know who to attach it to. Tails? What's going on? What's going on? What's going... What? Zero damage? Three times in a row? It's all Tails. And now he's charged. He's completely charged up. Gonna grab out Weemuscott and get rid of it. Fourth time's a charm, guys. Fourth time's a charm. Tails. Again. Yet again. Heads. Okay. Fine. Okay. Oh. Close. Four times 160 damage, 10 point hit points left. And finally, it's like, it's the Sharpedo is going to use his final attack. This card to double colors and sent this Bibero, but it's almost gone. Man. Man, okay. I'll send out Diggersby. It is now back in action. This Kangaskhan is good to go, so it's this is safe. We're going to use Dig. Get rid of this lucky, lucky Sharpedo. So yeah, I'm good. I'm immune to all damage. Man, that bit barrel was the worst bit barrel. <laughs> so here, well, welcome to another flipping awesome match where I pick. Why is my psychic powers tell me it's heads? I know it's tails. Yeah, I peeked there just a bit. So, no basic Pokemons. I have plenty of basic Pokemons. Oh man, come on. I know I got them. Okay, Bidoof. That's better than better than nothing. I do have the barrel too. Ooh. So, but I may have to birch or sycamore because I don't have any energies. All right, Cottonese in the back. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. Oh, I need an energy. I just want an energy, guys. So, Bidoof, he doesn't care. Look at him. He's so relaxed. It's like ah, Gengar, no problem. Tyranodar, no problem. This is a problem. It's a problem. Okay, let's go ahead and put a trick coin on. Birch. You gotta do this for me, man. You gotta do this for me. Yes, it is heads, but can I can you give me good cards? I have a Wim Wee Mascot. You know what? Let's go ahead and charge you up. And we'll put a stadium down just because I have both stadiums. So if we discard it, I'll just discard it back. And we'll attack this Gengar EX. And Bidoof is like, don't worry. It's just, it's okay. It's just a ghost. An EX ghost that has immense power. Heads. Oh, no. If he's got double colors energy, I'm gone. Weakness boss. Here. I don't have dark Pokemons. Is not a double colors. He can only do 30 damage to Cottony. Okay, we'll just evolve it to... Uh, Wims we miss Scott and now it's you gotta you gotta do more damage to me man so now okay you've gotta get me Bibero you gotta get me Bibero we gotta take this Gengar out this is not Bibero we may just have to retreat okay I'll send Bidoof out 
I'll put that on Kangas Khan. Trainer Mail, what you got for me? You got a Trick Coin. That's good. I'll take that. And now I do not want Gengar to hit my fully charged up the barrel or Bidoof. So I'll send the other Bidoof out. And despite doing that, let's go ahead and put Trick Coin on this. This Bidoof is like, you know, it's also looking looking pretty happy. So yeah, you take the hit for me. I wonder what's gonna do. Is it gonna snipe my bench or is it just gonna take out Bidoof? 60 damage, but with the poison, I'm gone. Goodbye, Bidoof. I'm sorry. And it's gonna ask to retreat. So Tyranor is like, wait, what'd you send me out? I don't have any energies. Uh, I'm sorry. Kangaskhan. We're definitely gonna send Kangaskhan gone out, guys. And Winona. Man, this will give me everything I need. But I sent Kangaskhan out. You know what? Risk. I'm gonna use Sycamore. Okay, that's what I wanted. I wanted to charge up. Let's throw down Bunnelby. And I'll hold on to Trick Coin for now. So, let's go ahead and attack. Triple draw. Alright, we got Diggersby. We still do not have a Barrel, But Diggersby can get it quickly charged up. Oh, Tyrandar is getting charged up. Oh, dang. It's, it's a... Tyrannosaurus-like monster versus a Tyrannosaurus-like monster. I mean, they look the same, right? Same body shape. So, all right, we got double colors. Let's just throw ahead the other Kangaskhan down. We put the trick on a Bundle B. Devolve it to Diggersby. Did I lose any? Think worth using Sacred Ash for? Nah. Okay, Birch. I don't really care, man. Just do whatever. But I prefer heads. Okay, Tails. I know it. I know it. The barrel is out. Okay. I gotta do this, guys. I gotta do this. Kangaskhan, you go back. The barrel, you go up. And let's go try and knock this out. Here we go. Continuous headbutt. Give me heads. Yes. If it's heads... Oh, okay. That's fine. Or is it? <laughs> let's go again. Let's go again. Let's go again. <laughs> the barrel. Only zero damage when it could have done 80. And maybe something magical might happen. So he's... You got lucky, Tyranidar. That's what Bibarel has been saying. You got lucky. Zatu. Zatu. What does this do? Zatu can do... It can, I guess, arrange the cards of my deck in a terrible order. Or his deck in an awesome order. So he's going to charge up Tyranidar. Luckily, it can't attack yet. So Bibarel... What is this? You, your Pokemon has no resistance. Uh, that... I don't... That's like... that. Okay. We're going to say nothing about that. Stadium Trainer Mail, give me something awesome. Sycamore, that is awesome. Let's charge up an energy on Diggersby. Diggersby, we're not going to buy Cottony. I'm not going to throw you down. Because I think I put, yeah, we must got down there already. So, okay. Let's, I don't need the stadium yet. Let's go ahead and send Bidoof down. Come on, man. You can do this. Tails. Do it again. Come on, heads, heads. Perfect. It was, I'm just, I have to take, oh, one more, one more, one more. Oh, oh, oh. but 160 damage, almost KO, and it is almost done. Are you going to put another energy on? He is going to put energy on and only do 60 damage. Maybe I should send the Weem Scott out. And I don't want Gengar to take it out yet. I'm going to save it. And then I'm gonna, when it goes down, I will take out, um, I will use Sacred Ash. So, anything I should do. Nope, I'm good, guys. Or I can try to find Mega Kangaskhan. Nope, I'm good, guys. So, we're gonna use Continuous Headbutt. Come on. Heads. Perfect. Perfect. That's enough. That's all I need. And 80 damage. We just, the barrel just went face to face with Tyranodar. Two prize cards. Awesome. And Gengar is going to come out, attack it, and, and it's going to switch out with a, one of these bench Pokemon, which is going to be funky. Ooh, this Velto. I got this. I got this, guys. So Velto is going to come out, and Bit Barrel is going to go down. And this, is, this will be a good time to use Sacred Ash afterwards. 60 damage. I'm sorry, Bit Barrel. But it just happens. And now who are you going to send out? Zatu? Okay. Okay. So, we're going to send out who? 
We're gonna send them. All of a sudden, Kang is gonna get out, guys. All right, let's play. Let's play teammates. Let's get Mega Kangas Khan and Lysander out because I need those cards. And I'll I'll charge up this Kangas Khan. We're gonna go ahead and use Sacred Ash. Ooh, plenty of Pokemons. I want my Wemus Scott team. And I I guess I'm running low on Digger Speed, so let's go ahead and grab those out, as well as uh, a a barrel. Okay, all back into my deck. And should I go Mega? I'm going Mega. Let's go ahead and throw this down. I'll leave the stadium up there because I don't really need to retreat. We can just discard it. Mega Genghis Khan is up and up at the front. We must got us right in the rear to take care of it. Oh man, I hope I can pull the combo up. Oh, why did you quit? Why did you quit? No. no. You made it to the end. Congratulations. So, my thoughts on this deck. It's reliably random. It's random when you depend on coin flips to make the magic happen. There's magic, so it's fun. But, it, you know, it, it can turn back on you, which is why it's this deck is more fun to watch. And, well, I guess it's fun to use too, but not to send through, you know, a competitive tournament match. You get the idea. You get the idea. So, it's the weekend. I'll be seeing you next Monday, and we're going to start off with the Heavy Impact Dragon Knight. Two prize cards per kill? Yes! Tuesday, I know I threw up a lot of games out there. There were a lot of comments. Thank you very much, guys. And I decided I'm really just going to pull forward with one, which is Overwatch, and not the rest. So that's more on it on Tuesday. Wednesday, Primal Kyogre. I get this one a lot, so, alright, here it is, guys. Thursday, mixing elements. What does fire provide for other Pokemons that are not its type? That kind of stuff. Because next expansion is going to be a lot of that. And Friday, Magmas Akron. Has a camera up in it. This is for you, the Rainbow Pit. Okay, so I'm about to read the comments or answer the comments for Wednesday's video, Dragon Rayquaza. So I know some of this is not for you. So for that, please like the video if you liked it subscribe to my channel if you haven't because if you get more awesome videos like this if you're ready to thank you very much and leave me any comments and i'll ask answer you on monday and don't forget to follow me on twitter and facebook so let's get to the comments we're gonna start off with evil apple if you said and i know you've just been here around since my first hundred so i checked out your video it's a good start man keep it up dude Michael C. finally showcasing Dragon Mayquaza. Yeah, just like it. But Rashir, I'm going to get this a lot, but you know, you just have to be a little bit crazy, a little bit different, and it wasn't doing as well as I thought because of the Romatisse was just doing such a good job, and it, it didn't. I did try it. Maybe if I changed the deck up a bit. And Mahir Rashid, you've been tagged by Blue Golf Ball for her. Poker Rap. Rub's hand looking for this. Man, whose side are you on? Dank, Danky Kang. Do you think dragon types would be used if there are no dragon energies? They're so awesome. I don't think so, man. That's why it's there. Might that poor Pyro user, nothing would have stopped it. Yep, yep. Thank you, Mike. Nifty Gaming. This is by far the most interesting decks I've seen. Whoa, thank you. I'm glad you liked it. Isaiah for Phoebus. Yeah, George Lucas. Cool deck. But just for fun. Just like this one. Thanks, man. And Luis Hendrick. Dude, you had you could put down a Hydra Gun and get a free retreat. Didn't notice it, but hey, that that scoop up fixed it up, but that was more that was much more cooler, right? Yeah. Thank you, Meridian Craft. I love any deck with aromatease. Oh, that's gonna come back this uh, Monday. And melodic. Definitely good, definitely good. Yep, thank you, Meridian. Evie. You should make a less clunky deck version using Rashium. It was clunky with Rashium, so I took it down. Maybe a different way exists, though. And Holy Cats, cool take on Dragon Rayquaza. Rashium. It's so... Let me be a little bit different, guys. And Diogo Morera. I said it before. I said, man, you're the man. Thank you, Diogo. And Tarai. Hey, Dolph. Dolph. My name is Donald. I've recently found your channel. Thank you for helping me unwind 
after a long day of work. You're welcome, man. And thanks for thanks for subscribing. And Mr. Pokemon Sir T C G T C G, I love your name. Love this. And I love to play this. It's a tank. Nice video. Thank you. Jonas Mark. Have you competed in tournament cities and league challenge? I don't actually have Pokemon cards. Maybe I will someday though. Man, iPod Cheese, download all your music. Yes. Love this so much and it just makes a chill, relaxing sound. I'm glad you like it. Well, some of them are other composers I like too, so definitely check them out. And Victor Wu, Dark Dragon Road Stacks. I know, I missed it, but it made an epic move with the scoop up, right? I guess not, I guess not. Okay, Victor Rodriguez, is Kurumi his waifu or something? It's Kurumi. Hmm. And Kung Fu Pan Cham. Hi, I want to ask you if you would do a Halloween deck. I may save some ghosts for the Halloween. Hmm. All right. Peek about. Thanks for checking my channel. You're the best. You're welcome, man. Aaron Leatherboro. Thanks for leaving the losses in the video. No one wins. I'll... Why do you want to see me lose so much, man? And Mimo Lozano. Any chance you have a sigil for Dark Patch? Or tr no, I don't have any. I don't have any of those cards. Sorry, man. And Rubens Lopez. Shields are a Dune Iron Mega Rayquaza deck, please. That's so popular. It's not unusual. It's so cool. Maybe, but you know, you know. Oscar Simichin. I understood correctly. You could use a new Fire Engine XY Break only for Fire Pokemon, but it would have been so awesome if Mega Rayquaza could use it in Polylolito. It was nice to see a loss. What side are you on? Thank you, Paul. Okay, now, breakthrough expansion. If you left me a comment on this, I'm gonna answer it too. So, my hero sheet. Typhlosion's finally in this set. I can see that's your favorite Pokemon. That's gonna be a weird one to pull off. And, Tommy Tiddle, you read Zoroark's mind jack wrong. It actually stacked and damaged the more bench Pokemon your opponent has. I was going a little too quick with that. You're right. You're right. And empowered him. Can I ask who that girl? What girl? Hmm. Okay. And Ram Rasmus Lundmoiler. Knocked out is good. When you have Vileplume, your opponent can't get rid of those items into damage. They might stack up. Hmm. Man, you guys have good ideas. Thank you, Rasmus. Gam Gamaliel Colon. Xerneas with evolution will be broke. Yeah, I, I'm not sure how the typing will work. You know, do the multiple type counts? We'll see, we'll see. That's why the new stadium's out to counter that. Ah, all right. Uh, Demetrius Kotalian on you. Uh, yeah. Yes, I, I, Zora, I, I messed it up. I it fixed it in the annotations though. And the King Joe 2004, sad to say, but I have a dense. Well, you catch up on that, man. And. Darian Houndoom and my Nick Starmie for Starmie? Okay, Houndoom. Okay. It might work. Maybe you can make it somehow. And Powdoom, hey, you get nominated for the poker rap with Blue Golf Ball. Why do you do this to me? Okay. Top tier Pokemon. Looking at Mega Galley, just drop a rainbow energy to add 10 hit points. I think it's 10 damage counters, if I'm not mistaken. Which makes it a little weird. Okay. Orlando Rojo. For Behemoth, the English actual text is different. The attack is 20 to one of your opponent's timed amounts of energy attached to that Pokemon. So it's going to be still an okay bench sniper. Hmm. We'll have to see on that. And Wanky Shan, you can see that you can see that it's going to weaken Rayquaza deck. Zora Arc, Parallel City. Man, Parallel City is just going to destroy Rayquaza. I don't know if it can exist. Might need that Ninetales now. And the Oigo Barrera, good review, fast, well informed. Thank you, man. Yep, Zoroark. Yep, yep. Vasu Sharma. Just get the Sea Wave, or the healing, yes, the, the stadium. But we gotta find some way to damage it, though. Yeah, okay. Gengar, Crobats, Instant Chaos. That's gonna happen, man. That's gonna happen. And Polyon's gonna break decks. Latios, that kind of ready. Savor it. Thank you, Ramon. And, yeah, uh,. Shaco Tan and Kung Fu Pancham, awesome, nice review. Thank you, Kung Fu Pancham. Stuben, you read Zora Arc. Oh, I should have fixed that. Okay, 
Matthew Atkinson. Perhaps the pincer does well with like the aqua stuff. Now we do have we do have cheaper ones like Bear Tick and um, Fortress. So you know may not need that more expensive pincer. Sea Bear Gaming, you skipped over Bill's one, which is much better than Mammoth's one. I saw that. That's gonna be amazing with the Shrine of Memories. Definitely gonna pull that one off. And the Lavian Typhlosion. Man, you guys love Typhlosion. And finally, here's your Bureau deck, man. And, alright, that is it. So, I'll see you Monday in a Girls in the French Jewels.